Don't be a dummy. Go spend your money at BigBadToyStore.com. Hello and welcome, my friends. The Iron Hulk is back bringing you another action figure review. Today we have... Ooh, someone pretty sweet. We have the Marvel Legends Infinite Series, Nova. Now, Nova is part of the comic series. He's not part of the Gardens of the Galaxy movie, um, despite why he's in this uh, series. But that's because, you know, he's kind of in part of the Gardens of the Galaxy world, I believe. Um, but before I show the figure, let me show the box. We got this cool artwork of Nova. Um, not as exciting as the other Gardens of the Galaxy um, box art pictures, but still pretty cool. Um, we got this really, really lame product picture of him. Kind of just, you know, just hanging out, attempting to fly. But once again, purple is cool. It's got the Marvel logo instead of the Guardians of the Galaxy logo. That's it. It's purple. It's cool. I'm over it. On to the figure. We got Nova. Nova. I really like this figure. I think he's one of the best in the series of these series, like the Guardians of the Galaxy figure series. Um, I think his proportions are great. He is based off of, off of a mold. I don't remember what mold he's based off of. Um, I believe it's like a Captain America figure, maybe. It has to be, because it's got like that, you know, very streamlined mold. Um, but he looks awesome. He's got this really sweet look to him. And I always thought Nova was a pretty cool looking figure. Um, I do know that these top pieces are... Oh, wait. Yeah, no, this top, bo this top part of the body is based off of um, Ultron. Did I say Ultron? Yeah. Ultron, yeah. Um, that his body from the Iron Man 3 wave. So, I guess that's what it's from. But, no, very cool figure. He's sturdy. Like, he feels like a cool action figure. And um, he's got some pretty badass articulation. Um, the coloring on him is awesome. I do like the star on his back. Very cool. And his face sculpt is awesome as well. He doesn't have any eyes. He's just kind of like this, like, you know, when the Ninja Turtles have just their white eyes look. He's kind of got that going on. Um, and chest is pretty cool looking. If you look deep enough, you see a face. Just saying. Might have just ruined, ruined this review for you. I am so sorry. But, um, yeah, he's got the belt got the little stripes here so not crazy detail but the paint's really fun he's got like this cool shiny look to him really exciting um so you guys bucket head and it goes up pretty well so he's on like this little little head rocker yeah. little joint there he's got the articulation here on his arms or on his shoulders so you can do some fun poses with that he's got the ball jointed arms uh swivel bicep double pinned elbows and his wrist can swivel and go up and down. He's got a nice ratchet ab crunch. You can hear that click. And um, he's got, once again, the, he's got the Star-Lord pinned leg, or upper legs. So he can't do any splits, but he can, you know, he can kind of chill like that. No big deal. Um, he's got nice double pinned knees. More sliding. Yeah! I don't know why I keep doing that. And um, kind of a rotational ankle pivot, but not anything too crazy, unfortunately. I'm sure if you can just like scrape some of this off, you can make that joint a little bit more functional. But yeah, here he is. I really like him. I think he's a fun figure, and he goes well with the other team members of the Guardians of the Galaxy, despite him not being in the movie. Um, here's with Drax. He's a little smaller than Drax, but... Um, yeah, I like how he's kind of just this decent figure. There's nothing crazy about him. He's just a fun-looking figure, and he's well-articulated. Um, the paint job's really sweet. Like, there's nothing wrong with this paint job. I think it's pretty solid everything with this guy. He comes with, I believe, uh, his right arm, Groot's right arm. So, there you go. So, yeah, I think he looks cool. Um... He's a standard Marvel Legends type body, and it works for me. So until next time, my friends, the Iron Hulk is signing off. Adieu.